And we welcome you back. We just reset our uh, camera that was getting very pixely, so you can have a better experience. The score is 20 to 25. The Saddle River Day Rebels lead the Pascal Hills Broncos. We thank you for joining us here on the PH Athletics YouTube channel. And we thank you for sticking with us through our uh, issues with the quality of the stream and our issues with the camera. We hope that now those have been fixed. But with five minutes, 20 seconds to go in the second quarter of this one, it's the Broncos down by five, but Sam Cooper is bringing it up for Pascal Hills. He gives it back out to Luckman who fakes the three. He gives it over to Anikian and swings it to Cole Piscotti. And now Sanders has it up on the wing, now pulls up long two is gonna be good there. And a timeout here from Saddle River Day. So we will be back in just a few moments here as Saddle River Day takes a timeout. So the score 25-22 now as the Broncos only down by three. It'll be Saddle River Day with the ball coming in. Zero will inbound to 15 here and we will begin once again. 15 gives it to 30 and 30 over to one. He takes a three, no good and Cooper brings it down. Over to Onikian now who puts one up in heavy coverage, it cannot go down as now 15 brings it down, he gives it over to zero. And zero over to 30 now. 30 fakes to one, now over in the corner. Three, no good there, but 23 gets it, he goes up and gets the layup. So Nick Luckman inbounds to Sam Cooper, and now it is Piscotti who gives it out to Luckman. Luckman out to Sanders now. Sanders over to Piscotti. Piscotti takes the two, it's no good. Down to Sanders now, back to Cooper. Into Luckman, reverse layup is good. And now it's just a three point game once again. 23 over to 15, now over to 30. 30 over to one. Gonna give it back to 30 now. He'll give it to 23. 23 over to 15, now one in the corner. One to zero, no good. Sanders tipping it up, he can't get it to fall. 23 puts one up, gonna be fouled. Foul's gonna be on Tyler Sanders, number 23 for Hills, his first. It'll be two shots from the line for number 23 from Saddle River Day. And he makes the first one as 14 comes in for 30. And good now from 23. So that makes it now a five point game as Sam Cooper brings it up the court. Now it is Cole Piscotti. And now Sam Cooper with it again. Now Luckman takes the three, it's no good. And now 14, he's got it. 14 brings it up for the Rebels, he gives it to 23 now, back over to 14. Now back to zero, zero over to 14, and now one, who gives it back to zero. And now to 23, and another dunk! From number 23 there, it's 31 to 24. Two minutes, 40 seconds remain as Onikian gives it back to Cooper. Now Sanders and now Luckman in the corner, fires it back to Cooper, takes the three from the wing and gets it. 31-27 is the score now and it's just a four point game as 14 brings it back up. 
He gives it over to 23 and now 14 with it once again. Over to zero. Zero to 14. Now zero with it once again. Over to 15, now one in the corner. Gives it to 15, now 23. 23 puts one up, no good. Brings it back down and gets the layup. Two minutes before halftime here. As Cooper all the way up to Piscotti on the left corner, almost lost his footing there, gave it into Sanders, now out to Cooper. Cooper back to Sanders, travel. Inbound here for the Rebels, 14 into 10. As a three from one, it's no good. Sanders brings it down. Now up to Cole Piscotti, one minute 30 to go. Now it is Sanders who takes the two from the elbow and gets it. So down to a four point game once again. One minute 15 seconds to go in the half. 14 brings it up. Now 10, now back to 14 up top of the key. Back to 10 now. 10 back to 14. He gives it to 23. 23 now zero. Zero over to 14. Now 10. He takes the two and gets it. So back to a six point lead. 50 seconds to go. Piscotti. Now, now Cooper. Now it is Onikian who pulls up from the elbow. Can't get it. Gets his own rebound. Gives it out to Cooper. Swings it to Piscotti. Three. No good. Taken out by 10. 30 seconds to go. 10. Settle River Day with a six point lead. One puts the corner three up. It's no good. Onikian with 30 seconds to go. He gives it to Cooper. They'll reset. Cooper over to Onikian. Onikian back to Cooper. Oh, it's stolen. No, it goes out of bounds. And 10 sliding in front of the bleachers to get it, and he is down. But he gets back up very quickly as Nick Luckman is going to come in here for... I uh, don't know who came off. Apologize. Nick Luckman, I apologize there. Luckman was still on. He just came over to Coach Paul DeRico to get some words and... I mistook it for him subbing in. 23 with the three to end it. It's no good in and out. And so we will go to halftime with a better camera quality and a six point game. 35 to 29 is the score. Saddle River Day leads Pascac Hills. We'll be back in about 10 minutes.
And we welcome you back here to the Michael J. O'Brien Court inside of Pascack Hills High School. I'm Matthew Merlino. Welcome back to our main event of the evening. It's the Pascack Hills Varsity Broncos taking on the Saddle River Day Rebels. They're currently up 35 to 29. It's a six point lead for the Rebels and they'll have the ball coming in. Once again, unfortunately, we were unable to get a roster from the Rebels, so we will just go by their numbers. 30 inbounds to 14, and we're back underway. Back over to 30 now. Oh, tipped out by Luckman, but it goes to two anyways. A rebound there from 23, and he makes the layup for the first points of the half. Now it'll be Cole Piscotti who takes it up for the Pascal Kills Broncos. Piscotti crossing over, looking for a way in. Almost lost it, got it back though. Now to Luckman. McLuckman over to Tyler Sanders, now number 23, crossing over. Now back to Onikian and now to John Stewart. Into Sanders, takes the two, it's no good. And now 10 will bring it up for the Rebels. 10 now to 11 and a travel. So it'll be Onikian on the inbound here. He will go to Cole Piscotti and the Broncos set it back up. Now Piscotti over to Onikian, now it is Stewart. Into Luckman, but it does not work out. It goes out of bounds. So 10 brings it up. 14, now 10, now 11, back out to 14. Oh, off a foot of Luckman there. Goes out and it'll be an inbound for the Rebels. Now it's 10 who has it off the inbound from 14. He's gonna give it in to 11. He loses it and it goes to the Broncos. Onikian on the inbound, we'll give it to Cole Piscotti and we'll get back underway. Oh, Sanders lost it, hit his head and it goes to Saddle River Day. 11 out of 14, got the layup. Here's Piscotti who takes it up the court. He's got it to Luckman. Luckman now to Sanders. And now it's Onikian. Onikian puts it up and gets it. 39 to 31 here is the score. 14 brings it up. Saddle River Day in control of the ball and the score. As 11 gives it out to 10. 10 over to 14, now into 11, out to 30. He takes the three from the wing and gets it. Now Piscotti with it. He brings it up the court. Piscotti tried to give it to Onikian but lost it. 10 gets it, gives it over to 11 and makes the layup. 44 to 31 is the score as Onikian gives it into Sanders. Sanders crossing over, now Onikian. Now it is Stewart who has it. He gives it over to Sanders once again and Sanders takes the three, no good. Sanders gets it on the ground, but it'll be a jump ball. It'll be a Bronco inbound here as five minutes, four seconds remain in the third quarter. 44 to 31 is the score. Broncos losing by, well, I was going to say 13, but that's just changed because Nick Luckman with that three in the corner has made it a 10 point game. 14, now 30. Now 14 with it, he gives it into 23 and now 30. Travel gonna be called on the Rebels here, number 30, and it'll be an inbound for the Broncos again. Onikian to Piscotti. Low, 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 low. 
Here's Scotty, now over to Luckman. Sanders has it. Ooh, Onikian loses it, and it goes to the Rebels here. Now it is 10, or 14, and we'll bring it up for the Rebels. And he will give it out to 30. 30 back to 14, swings it to 10. 10 with the dump off to 23 and gets the contested layup. Now it's Onikian to Piscotti. Piscotti to Onikian, now back to Luckman. Luckman takes the three, it's no good. Goes to 10. 10, gonna take the three, no good there. Sanders cannot haul it down, it's 14 with it. And Sanders tried to get it back, couldn't. And a foul called here. Foul gonna be on Nick Luckman here, his first, and the first team foul of the half. Two from the line for 23. Misses the first one. Morning, Gonzaga, guys. Go, 23, he makes the second. Now Onikian, Justin Onikian, he'll give it up to John Stewart. Stewart over to Sanders, back to Stewart. And now over to Nick Luckman. Luckman now to Tyler Sanders. Now it's Cole Piscotti. Piscotti gives it out to Sanders, now over to Stewart. Stewart over to Piscotti in the corner, crosses over. Gives it out. As Stewart drives in a big block by 23, but it will stay with the Broncos as 15 comes in for 30 here. It'll be Onikian on the inbound. Looking for someone. Three minutes remain in the third quarter. He gives it to Sanders, and Sanders cannot make the short two. 14, now 10. Into 23, puts it up, and one. The Saddle River, number 23 here. Foul is gonna be on John Stewart, his third. Two from the line for 23, or sorry, one from the line. On the end, one, and he makes it. Two minutes 55 to go as Piscotti brings it up. He gives it over to Onikian. And Onikian out of Stewart. Now it's Luckman who's got it. Travel gonna be called on Luckman. As 13 comes in for 15 here. 14 coming out as well. 15 staying in, I apologize. As 15, now to 10, and the Rebels will start again. Two minutes, 30 seconds to go, and counting here in the third quarter. And that'll stop as the Rebels take a 30-second timeout. We'll be back in a few moments. We welcome you back here as the Rebels will have an inbound. It'll be 11 inbounding to 10, and we're back underway. 
10 over to 13, almost blocked by Onikian. Back over to 10, and it's going to be called for a backcourt. Oh. It did look like a backcourt violation, but it was very close up to the discretion of the referee there. My opinion is he made the right call. Onikian now to Cooper. Cooper to Onikian. Three good from the wing. As two minutes remain here in the third quarter, it is Ten who brings it up. Crosses over, looking for a way around this double coverage of Onikian and Sanders gives it out to 13. Oh, 23, and a foul gonna be called here. On John Stewart. And that is Stewart's fourth foul. One more and he, and he will foul out. Three team fouls to none for Pascal kills against Saddle River in this half. 13 out to 23. And Cooper with the steal. He puts it up and gets it. Now it is 10 who will bring it up the court. Ten gives it over to zero, up to 13, now out to 15, now 13 with it again, he gives it to 10. 10 to 13, and now 15, he gets the layup. So one minute, 25 seconds remain and counting here in the third quarter, 52 to 39 is the score. Cooper lost it, gets it back though, now Sanders with it. Sanders over to Stewart, now Luckman. Onikian is going to give it to Stewart. Blocked by 23 there, and it goes the other way. Here is 10. Puts one up and gets the layup. 54 to 39, the score. Under a minute to go. Here's Luckman. Gives it to Stewart. Now Sanders takes the three and gets it from the top of the key, and it was contested. And a timeout here from the Broncos. A 30 second timeout. And we welcome you back here as the score 54-42 with 47.7 seconds remaining in the third quarter. It is the Saddle River Day Rebels who lead the Pascal Kills Broncos and the Rebels will have the inbound. It is 10. 10 crossing over. He's going to bring it up and puts one up from the foul line and gets it. So that will make it now a... 14 point game as Cooper gives it over to Sanders. Sanders now to, to Stewart and now Luckman for three. It's no good and brought down by Saddle River. The Rebels number zero brings it up. Now 13 turning around gives it to 23. In their double coverage layup still good. Sanders in, inbounds to Cooper and Cooper to Sanders now. Stewart put it up to end the quarter. No good. And we'll go to the end of the third. The score 58 to 42. We thank you for joining us so far here on the PH Athletics YouTube channel. I'm Matthew Merlino. We'll be back in a minute for our final eight minutes of action.
So we sort out a little thing with the clock now, and we're ready to begin the fourth quarter. It is zero, gives it into 13. Now 15 with the winged three there, and now Cooper will inbound to Onicki, and now back to Cooper to score 61 to 42. It's a 19 point lead for Saddle River Day over the Broncos. Onicki, and oh, tried to give it to Sanders, and it goes the other way, 14 with a layup. So now Cooper takes it up. He gives it over to Sanders, Sanders to Stewart. Now Luckman into Onikian, and he puts the layup up to make it now a 19-point a game once again. 14 taking it up. And now Cooper, fast break to Onikian, and he makes another one. Fourteen zero, fifteen in the corner for three, and good. It's a twenty-point game as Luckman. Now it is Stewart into Sanders. Can't get it though. Fifteen now. Fourteen will take it up. Fourteen, now it is fifteen who has it. Back over to fourteen, takes the long three from the top. It's no good. Goes out and it will go the Broncos way. So Sanders will get it. Now it is Sam Cooper who takes it up. And he'll give it to Sanders. Sanders now to Onikian who pulls up for the long two and gets it. So it is zero who has it. Now 15 into 23 and out to 14. Back to 15 now. He gives it over to 14 and now zero. Now 13 for three from the wing. It is good. And that will make it a 21 point game. So here is Cooper taking things up. Now it is Sanders, now Stewart, and now Cooper for three, no good. Stewart gives it out to Luckman. Luckman out to Stewart, takes the three and gets it. Even with some contact from Saddle Rivers number 15 there, Stewart not phased, gets the three. 14 takes it up. That is zero, he takes the three from the wing, it's no good. It goes out of bounds, subs coming in, it is 30. And 10 coming in for 15 and 13. And it will be an inbound for the Broncos here, Onikian to Cooper. So it is Cooper who puts it up. No good, but a foul. So Cooper will go to the line for two. And the foul will be on Saddle River number 30, their first team foul of the half, and number 30's second. And he's the only player to foul tonight for Saddle River Day. Cooper makes the first of his two foul shots. Misses the second one, so it's a 17 point game here as 14 takes it up the court. He gives it over to 10 now, crossing over, gives it over to 14, and he kicks it out to zero. He kicks it out to 14 in the corner, gives it over to 23, takes the long three, no good. Luckman brings it down, loses it, it goes back to Cooper. Cooper over to Stewart now. He gives it to Onikian and now Cooper with it. Now it is Stewart back over to Onikian. Into Luckman, but a foul called before he could shoot. Foul's gonna be on number zero here, his first.
Sanders has it. Now it is Luckman, but no good on that one. Oh, Luckman on the floor. Oh no, 30, corner three, and he got it. That isn't good. That was a spill, or Luckman fell, and I don't think it was due to the play as they're uh, looking to see if the court has any water on it. So it'll be an inbound for the Broncos as the issue is fixed. Sam Cooper will bring it up. Cooper over to Sanders now on the wing. He gives it over to Stewart. Now Luckman. Luckman can't get it to fall, gets the rebound and gets it. 72 to 54 is the score. High scoring affair here. 14 at a zero, out to 30. And so 14 now, he's gonna look to drive in, but he can't, kicks it over to his 10 here. He tries to drive in with a, a travel, I guess, but 30 makes the layup nonetheless after the pass. So 74 to 54, it's a 20 point game. Three minutes remain. Now Onikian, oh, tried to give it to, I believe, Cooper, but 30 was there and made the interception, but a big block from Cooper, it's a foul. Two from the line as Cooper gets his first foul. Out comes the entirety of the Broncos squad. In comes Daniel Frusteri, Aaron Lee, Alex Banting, and Charles Stewart, brother of John. So 30 made one, but the Rebels with it still. A timeout now from Saddle River Day with two minutes, 34 seconds remaining. 75 to 54 is the score. We'll be back in a minute. And we're back now as 11 now on the court for the Rebels. They changed out pretty much their entire team. 20 gets it now. And he gives it out to 25. Nice kick out and a nice three from the wing there. 78 to 54 is the score. Alex Banting taking it up the court. About two minutes to go. He gives it to Daniel Fusteri. And now it has been Stahl. Now it's Banting again. Now Aaron Lee. Lee gives it to Stahl. Stahl, layup is good. And now 25 will take it up. He gives it to 20. Now it is 11 who takes the long three and gets it from the wing. So Banting taking it up. Minute 45 to go and counting. Banting gives it over to Stahl. Stahl now Lee, but a foul after a little bit of contact. Foul's going to be on Saddle River 11, his first. So Banting to Lee, almost lost it. And another foul, it's going to be on black number 11. 
Out of River number 11 is second in a row. Both teams with four team fouls. One minute 34 to go. Stall on the inbound for the Broncos. Gives it back to Banting. And now Banting gives it to Stahl. Oh, a big block and interception by 11. He almost dunks it on the way to the layup. Now for Steri to stall. 83 to 56 the score. One minute to go. Lee puts one up. No good. Stall with it. But it goes the other way. 11 with it now. One minute and counting to go. 35 to 25. Out to 20. Puts it up, no good. Foul gonna be on Aaron Lee here, his first, and it'll be two from the line for 20. 50 seconds to go. Good on the first free throw, 84 to 56. The score is 15 comes in. Now 20 gets it. So two free throws good there from 20. It's 85 to 56 the score, 45 seconds left. Alex Banting for three, no good. One brings it down, 40 seconds to go. 35 with it now, he's gonna give it out to 20. Under 30 seconds to go, 20 with the missed layup. Lee brings it down, gives it to Stahl. 20 seconds to go, Stahl to Lee. Lee with a nice kick out to Frusteri, corner three, no good. Foul here on Ben Stahl, his first. 14.1 seconds to go. 15 brings it up, 10 seconds to go. And let's see him dribble this one out. Four, three, two, one and zero. Final score 85 to 56, Saddle River Day. The Rebels defeat the Pascal Kills Broncos. We thank you for joining us here on the PH Athletics YouTube channel, your home for Pascal Kills Sports. I'm Matthew Merlino. This ends the regular season for the Broncos varsity team, but they will be back Tuesday. This coming Tuesday is President's Day weekend. We'll bring you their state sectional game against Lodi. That'll be right here Tuesday, starting around 7 o'clock p.m. Of course, if you want to see the entire Hills Athletics schedule, go to our hills.pascac.org website, navigate to the Athletics tab, and click on Schedules. For now, though, once again, this is Matthew Merlino. Thank you all for joining us.